Hey everybody, Al Williamson with LeadingLandlord.com. Today I want to talk to you about how to make $19,200 in just one day. Well, that's how much I increased the value by. Let's go to it. It's about creating a laundry nook. So this is my apartment complex. You guys see me talk about before. And in there I have with this uh, two bed, one bath, two bedrooms and one bathroom place. And let's look at this closet here. It's just oversized. Now this is a furnished rental. That's what I do is focus on extended stay, 30 day uh, rentals and longer. And looking at this closet, I'm saying it's got some extra space. Let's take part of it and make it into a profit center. And I talked about this first in my book, 40 ways to increase the net income of your rental property. It is uh, tip number 32, which is uh, rental appliances and furnishings. So I'm actually living out these 40 ways and I'm demonstrating them. Here, let me show you what I did. So this is the wall that we, we pointed to there and um, I cleared off everything and this is where we're going to cut a hole in, the, in that wall, open it up and it's going to enter into the closet. So I opened it. This is what it is. You can see right here, I got the shelf. This is kind of the old closet, okay? It goes to this bedroom. So we opened it. Then we, we put a backing there. This is where the dryer is going to sit. It's going to be a portable dryer. And then we framed the back of it. So we're going to put sheetrock and make it look really nice. And then we had to have a place for that dryer to exhaust to so we exhausted it and then we hung the dryer now this dryer hangs in place just the way a bicycle hangs on the back of a car trunk same type of device then we plumbed it using PEX and then we added this air emittance valve now usually you take these um, air vents and you take them all the way through the roof up to the ceiling all the way to the outside but we use this air emittance valve to make the makes the drain line flow at full speed. So this was the final thing is we did this all in one day and here's another shot of it. Hey, let's do a before and after. This is a before. This is what it looked like and we morph into what it looks like after. All right. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add this barn door, which is going to slide over it and you won't see it at all. There'll be some artwork on there. So that's the next step I'm, I'm doing. Okay. So why am I doing this is because I'm always looking for ways to make higher, better use out of the properties I already own. That's the thing. And then I'm, I'm trying to add more convenience to the people who live there. Again, they're coming for extended stay periods of time. Um, these are uh, people who are on business assignments. So they, they want a place to do laundry right there in their unit. I make my place more desirable. So I'm increasing the desirability of it. I'm also increasing the property values because I happen to own this place. And I'm gonna talk to you about that in just a second. And there's a quick payback for doing this type of thing. Let's look at the cost. The washing machine, and I'll leave the details of exactly what I put in there in the description. So check the description. The washing machine costs 319, the dryer 280, and um, parts and things. All together is about $709, okay? And then the benefit of doing this is that it's gonna increase my annual income by um, $960 a year. Okay, I'm increasing it by $80 a month because there's a washing machine there. And this thing pays for itself in, in just one year, so that's amazing. And that's increasing my, my cap rate, the valuation of my property, which is a commercial evaluation, by $19,200. So that's well more than the cost of these machines, that $900 the machines. And it's going to bring me superstar clients. That's what I really want. I want the best of the best people who are travelers, professional business travelers. I'm looking for the best of them. So that's why I'm creating something that they can't find elsewhere. And I want to be in demand. I want to be the homecoming queen. I want people uh, bidding over each other to get my place. That's what I want. So that's it. I want you to do the same thing. I want you to look to see if you have unused space that you can take it higher and better use. There's more ideas. There's 40 more ideas in, in this book, plus more than that. For, you can get that at Amazon. Check the link in, in the description. And I hope you see the benefit of what you can do. All, every landlord can create an extra 80 bucks. Check out the book that only costs 20 bucks to learn how to do that. Okay, if you have any questions, um, let me know. Tell me what you think. Leave me a comment. And if you're looking for more ways to increase your income, or to reduce your expenses, all you need to do is subscribe.